Model T Ford Club of America made it to the Flint Hills during its annual national tour. 13's Joseph Robin caught up with them today at Fort Riley. Pieces of the past rolled through Fort Riley Thursday. Pure enjoyment. I mean, they're not sitting in, in some warehouse or museum uh, rusting or collecting dust. They're right here using them and uh, letting the public get in there, touch them, uh, play with them, dry, ride in them. Aaron Frazier is part of the Model T Ford Club. Their national tour started Sunday at the Midwest Dream Car Collection in Manhattan. All week, some 80 classic Model Ts have toured scenic routes across East Central Kansas. Visits included Alma, Lake Wabunzi, the Church St. Columkill, and the Yellow Brick Road in Wamigo. We want people to come in from the rest of the world and see how beautiful it is here, and we've had mission accomplished. And uh, they just love Manhattan, and, uh, and they love the tours, and had no idea of the Flint Hills beauty and, uh, you know, the grassland, the scenic byways, the limestone, and the good food. Stu Tomlinson wants people to learn a little history of the Model T from these tours. Henry Ford got America on the wheels, and how he did that, he got America going with Model T Fords, and he was able to get the car in an average person's hand, and uh, and that's how it all started. So, you know, he, he had uh, the history of giving the country mobility. And uh, he not only did that in the United States, but internationally. Frazier says the people are what makes the tour so special. The people that you come up and meet and just want to talk. Um, some, some, you get some of the older people, and they, they want to talk about stories that they had uh, in their childhood. And, and that's just wonderful, wonderful time. I mean, just the people and the talking, uh, the social aspect of it is just wonderful. In Fort Riley, Joseph Robin, 13 News. The tour finishes tomorrow at 11 with a car show at Manhattan's Central Park. Check it out. Kansas